Welcome to Room 6, the channel dedicated to the local music scene and the people that make it, including me. I'm Josh, and today we're back at Soul Belly Barbecue for another songwriter showcase hosted by Hal Sabar. This event is really turning into something that feels like a community of familiar friends and at the same time feeling like a new adventure every week. I'm so glad Hal asked me to play a small part in it by live streaming and reviewing each performance. If you'd like to be on the showcase, hit up Hal Sabar here or using his social media down in the description. I've also included social media for every performer mentioned in this video. While you're down there, feel free to subscribe, like, and share. I'd appreciate it, and I thank you. Oh, and if you'd like to be featured on Room 6, hit me up using my email address or the Room 6 social media link down there as well. That's also where you can find ways to support the channel and help me support the scene. Thanks. Now then, who's ready to hear some awesome music and enjoy some tasty Q? What? Located on Brewery Row in downtown Las Vegas' art district, Soul Belly Barbecue is becoming the spot for great food and incredible live music. I've reviewed this venue in another video, so feel free to watch that when you're done here. Kicking things off as usual was our host, Hal Safar, who was joined on stage by friend of the channel and Hal's drummer for his cover shows, Amante the Drummer. Plus, the amazing Johnny Fab jumped on his keyboard to class up the joint. Breaking the ice on the evening, Hal and the guys regaled the crowd with a little backstory to each song before launching into music that was catchy, fun, and well-written. As always, it was a great way to start out the night. Following that amazing opening set was Johnny Fab, who, like most of the performers for the evening, has been a Room 6 alumni. After playing a song filled with emotion about past love, Johnny was joined by Hal, Amante, and his wife for a crowd sing-along that had the audience crooning along. It was so fun and a nice way to get everyone together. Coming up next was the amazing songwriter, Tara Trent. Tara's music is so full of positivity and joy that it's hard not to like it or her. There's an honest starkness to its simplicity while still being well-crafted songs full of history and it resonated with everyone present. The altered script was up next, bringing a pedal board full of promise to the night. Introducing a little space rock fused with emo and a dash of stoner rock thrown in for good measure, his set was an auditory curveball that reset the night in a good way. Returning after recently making the jump from appreciative spectator to new showcase guest was Lance Gittinger. Lance's music is straight ahead singer-songwriter fare, but it's done with passion and energy. It's good to see him back in the scene, and I look forward to hearing more from him. Coming up next was surprise guest Just Jeff, one half of Room 6 alumni, All at Odds. Jeff's music is just like him, quirky yet authentic and worth checking out. Simple storylines fused with talented phrasing help the listener follow along and enjoy the journey. Next on stage was David Wax, storyteller extraordinaire and future Room 6 guest. David is a master at power ballads and tale telling, and he's always a showcase favorite and always a treat to watch perform. As an added bonus, Monty jumped back on the drums to help him finish out his set. I'm looking forward to having him on the channel as well, someday soon. Another surprise guest hit the stage in the form of Zoe Day, also joined by Amante the drummer. Whenever I hear Zoe sing, two words come to mind. Passionate and powerhouse. Her vocals ring out strong and clear and are a great counterpoint to her guitar playing. It was so great to see her after a long absence from the showcase stage. With impromptu groups forming during the event, it was time for an actual band to grace the stage in the form of the Soulful Sons, headed by Quinn Turner, who's practically a fixture at the showcase by this point. This band was formed around Quinn Turner's music, which is fun and just the right amount of vintage sexy. Quinn and the band have been playing a lot of places lately, so catch them live if you can. Overall, this week's installment of the Songwriter Showcase at Soul Belly Barbecue went off great. I can't wait to see what next week will bring. See you there. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoy. I hope that you'll swing by Soul Belly Barbecue on Main Street in downtown Las Vegas if you're in the area, or I hope that we'll see you on the live stream next Sunday at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. I do my best to make everybody look the best I can, so it's always appreciated when people watch. Uh, I, brief note, if you're watching this by now, thanks for staying through the whole video. I appreciate you. Um, it matters. But also, here's a heads up. After this Sunday, the showcase is going to monthly performances. So um, stay tuned. Subscribe so you don't miss out. Uh, probably be doing some sort of you know update to that. Uh, in the meantime, remember to be amazing, and if you want to see more videos like this, click up here, 
If you'd like to subscribe, you know what to do. Click down there. Don't forget to ring the bell. Yeah, we'll see you next time on Room 6.